Hi everyone! So, by the title, I'm sure you've gathered that this is a video on how I curl my new short hair. A couple weeks ago, I chopped all my hair off, and I am absolutely loving it. So I've gotten a few requests on how I curl it, and here it is. So obviously, you need to have tangle-free hair. So I always spend, well, let's be real, about 20 minutes brushing this mess out. Um, and even if I do not have second day hair, I always spray dry shampoo in my hair. Um, especially my roots because I need all the help I can get in the volume department. So I clip half of my hair up and once again I run a brush through it because by this time, yep, I have more tangles. To curl my hair, I use a Hot Tools 1 inch curling iron that I took the clamp off of. So I always start in the back of my head and I just grab chunks of hair and start wrapping it around the barrel and I'll leave it on for about 10 seconds or so. For this hairstyle, I take different size sections of hair, um, you know, ranging from half inch to an inch, inch and a half, and I like to wrap each section around the barrel in a different direction. That way it gives more of a textured look and it almost looks like beachy waves. I tend not to be too, too picky about what the bottom layer of curls look like because um, they will be covered up by the top layer of curls. So I continue this method of curling until the entire bottom layer of hair is curled. Once it is all curled, I give it a quick spray with some hairspray just to ensure that the curls don't fall out too, too much. At this time, I take either a hair tie or a hair clip and I pin the entire bottom section back. That way it's out of my way and I'm able to curl my top layer of hair with no problems. And no, it does not ruin my curls at all. So then starts the journey of curling the top layer of hair. So I do the same thing. I wrap the hair around the barrel in different directions to give it more of a beachy look. That is what I like personally. Um, also, using the curling iron without the clamp helps that as well. After I take my hair tie out, I give it another quick um, spray of hairspray. And then this is where I start finger combing all of my curls out. And I also use um, a paddle brush or I'll just pull the curls apart like you see here. And um, it gives your hair more of a fuller effect. It makes it look like you have a lot more hair. Once all of my curls are pulled apart, uh, this is when I section off my hair and I give it a quick little tease. Um, and I always make sure to hairspray it after I tease each section. That way it does not fall out during the day. I will go back as necessary and curl any pieces that are looking a little bit straight or any pieces that need um, to be reformed. After I tease the rest of my hair, uh, once again I'll curl any pieces that need it and fluff up that hair and I am done! And this is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful. If you have any questions or you want to see a video on how I took the clamp off of my curling iron leave a comment down below. Don't forget to like this video and don't forget to subscribe for more and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!